guys, Michael Stilwell here from Stilwell Pianos in Mesa, Arizona, and I have a treat for you. So if you watch our videos, you know Mason and Hamlin is my favorite, favorite piano. It's what I have in my house, but I do not have a Mason and Hamlin like this. This is a double B, so it's a seven-foot semi-concert grand piano. It was made in 2006, and it was actually Brazil or uh, Indian Rosewood <laughs> when we got it. So we bought this piano from an estate. They had two Stein, they had two semi-concert grants. So they had a Steinway B and they had this Mason Double B. This Mason Double B was right in front of this humongous window with direct sunlight right on the lid. And in 2006, Mason and Hamlin was re, uh, finishing their pianos with polyester on top of the um, Indian rosewood. And when polyester gets a ton of sunlight like that, it kind of turns green. Uh, and I wasn't about to try to sell a Mason Hamlin Double B that was green. So. We hand rubbed all that down just to try to get it all the way down because polyester does not strip off like lacquer does. So we just basically had to agitate it a whole bunch and then relay black uh, gloss lacquer on top and then hand rub it out. And now it looks brand new, just like out of the factory. But what's super cool about this piano is because the bleaching was on the outside of the piano and not the inside, I was able to save this Indian rosewood inner rim which is absolutely stunning. And also in these models on the sides of the keys, they left the natural color on the sharps. So um, it really, really pops. This model uh, B or double B is right when they switch to this full circumference plate design, which uh, creates a lot more stability in the tuning. Um, and also in 2006, this is before they went to the, how should I phrase this? The I think they call it a composite action with WNG, Wessel Nickel Gross actions. So this is an actual real wood action. It's not the composite uh, with WNG action that are in all the new ones now. Some of you guys are going to really like that. Some of you guys won't. I personally dramatically prefer wood actions in pianos. And so this is a total bonus for me. Um, and you really be able to hear the, how beautiful and rich this piano sounds guys. These double B's are crazy powerful. Actually, I actually have two of them right now. So we have this one and then we have one that we're rebuilding in the back and they're just super, super cool. So uh, without further ado, oh yeah, I forgot. There's also a, a piano disc player system on this piano. Uh, we don't have the device to make it work right now. So we're gonna make this video with just the piano being played by Nicole, but it does have that system on it and it has a silent system. So there's a little feature. You can reach underneath that key bed right there and flip a little switch and a, and a little bar will flip up inside the action and stop the hammers about a centimeter before they hit the string. And then basically turn the thing into a keyboard so you can plug your headphones into the side of the piano, have headphones in, and the piano will be silent. You'll just hear from the hammers hitting the uh, little bar. And all you got to do to turn it off is one little flip of a switch and now you got your acoustic piano back. That's a crazy awesome feature. I love those things. To put that into perspective though, when we install those on other pianos, it's about $2,500 just for that feature. And this also has the Wi-Fi piano disc player system in it as well. So without further ado, I'll get out of the way. We'll have Nicole play this for you guys. But if you have any questions about this particular piano or any other piano on our website, always feel free to shoot me an email at michael at stillwellpianos.com. Thanks for watching, guys.